Hey YouTube, Garrett the man coming to you with everything Lego. I got uh, another tour. It's gonna be on the Lego City uh, Harbor, a tour that you guys have been waiting for a long time to come out. And so it's finally here, part one. It's so big I have to do it in two parts. This the boat and the transport truck and too many figures out of five minute figures is part one, and the dock and the crane is part two, and the three other minifigures. All right. Let me show the minifigure first. Let me get it into focus. Okay, super. First minifigure is, has glasses, wearing a construction helmet, and is wearing overalls, and he drives the transport truck. The captain, he has facial hair, oopsie, and a white hat, and uh, some glasses, a blue tie, a an anchor on his pocket, and black pants. I'll show you the transport truck now. But well, before I do that, I'll show you the container. It's a basic yellow block. Big old block. Made with a couple of wall elements. And it's got the transport symbol. That's pretty cool. I like the transport symbol. And here is the truck. It's very well designed. Two little headlights. And a big white fender. And a big grill. And whatever that bar right there is. There is the steering wheel, and a little air conditioning unit, and here's just the whole thing. There's supposed to be another one right here, but I'm using it for something else. And little tail lights, and a grill, and gray wheels. And there's supposed to be another smokestack, but I'm supposed to, not I mean, but I'm using that for something else too. And so the boat, I guess we'll start from the ground up and go from here on to here. Uh, the engine room. I don't think a lot of people know about this. Oopsies. That don't have this set. I don't know, but. You have the wrench and an axe for tools for the engine. The engine's cool. It's got little cylinders, which are awesome. Uh, put these back on. I don't know what the little bars right here are for, but but you know they gotta be something. I mean, you know they gotta be for something, and so it's cool. And so yeah, the tools and windows right there, and two crawl spaces for the minifigure to crawl into. Maybe I should move this over a little bit just so that the minifigure doesn't. I mean, just so that the guy doesn't get stuck on the tool right there. And so next floor. We have a steering wheel, and two levers, and some controls, and a green cylinder over there, and a red one here, a red light there, and a green light there, and some uh, some bricks with lines in them, two little lights, and some tiles, just so you can take this part off easier. This has a swirly thingy. Yeah, check out that swirly thingy. I don't know what you call it, but it's cool. And it's swirly. Here you have the antenna. You have another red light and another green light. And a little ball thing, I don't know what that's for, but it's cool. And a smokestack. Here is the other container. It's green. It's just like this, only green. And each and each one has a hook on the top for the crane. It only comes with uh, two, but which is too few, but at least it comes with one, right? Here's the next container, it's red, it's got a little uh, caution tape right there, and another little hook, and bars over the top, and some of the walls are missing, so you can see this nicely designed boat. Now this boat has a million uses, it could escort the cargo ship, it could be just to drive around the harbor or anything for transportation, uh, it's got an engine right here, which is pretty cool, little hot rod engine. Uh, windshield, which is, oopsies, which is just two roof pieces, and whatever you do, don't drop those, because they're really hard to lose, because they're like see-through and stuff, and a steering wheel, okay, and let me show you the cargo bed, it's got a bunch, I mean, it's got a bunch of space, it can fit, uh, Unlimited containers, if you have so many, they can go up to here. 
It's awesome. You have a little boardwalk right here just to get from one side of the ship to the other. And the little handlebar right here. There's supposed to be another one, but of course I'm using it for something else. Um, oh yeah, never mentioned this. But here is a little pallet, and it has barrels on it filled with gas or petrol, or depending on where you live. Oh, and each container has these little plates on the bottom so that they can stack easy. And it can stack without coming loose unless you just pull it off. So that's pretty cool. Oh, and it comes with, uh, it comes with six of them, by the way. The other one is just over here on the dock. And these are the same type that you get with the uh, service station, too. So that's pretty cool. I like how they make some of the sets compatible, you know. Here's the front part of the boat. It's got an antenna, two little bars right here, and some t and a wrench and a uh, broom. You know, clean up the front of the boat. And an anchor. Anchor's pretty cool. It's just plain black. And this, you can move it up or down. And the anchor is supposed to go in here, but no matter what, it cannot fit. I don't care what you say, this anchor cannot fit there in there anyway. And these little rocket launcher things right here. Oh, and uh, I forgot to mention this, but all over the boat you'll find little ladders. That's, that was a pretty good idea. All over the place, no matter where you go, you'll find a little ladder. And it's pretty cool. You could just have the anchor hang, go in the water. Or just hang on off the front like that. I prefer like that. Okay, this concludes part one of the har uh, of the Lego City Harbor tour. This is Gearhead the Band signing off. Please excuse my mom. Rate and comment. Bye. Hey guys, one more thing before I sign off. Could you just do me a favor and like not correct me? Not correct me. I mean, like if I call if in the video I called something that that it isn't. Please do not correct me because it just drives me insane! Have a nice day.